All right, so today with nothing, not a thing held back, I'm going to show you ways that you can leverage Google News to earn money online super fast as an agency. I showed you guys in the video. I think you could check this one out right here. You seem to like this one a lot. Okay, so we have a couple niches we're going to go after. Uh, this is going to be the tool that we use right here to scrape contacts after we... Uh, figure out what niche we're going to go into now make sure you guys check that out in a pinned comment but we're going to go straight to google news real quick and we're going to search for dealers car dealerships so you'll type car dealerships in so what you're going to get in this video is me showing you exactly how to find the local business that you'll earn money with using this google article this google news article and how to service them uniquely in a way that you can rapidly make money like before this friday what's today today is tuesday before this friday you can make a couple grand easy okay so we found car dealership so we're going to click on the news tab. This is for Google News. And what we want to look for, guys, is we want to look for problems, problems in the industry that are so bad that they made the freaking news. And what are we going to do? We're going to service them. How are you going to stand out? The good thing about this is that it's trending, meaning they're not being blasted with cold emails or DMs uh, by this problem yet. OK, so round rock dealerships see hell damage expect deals for dented cars so here's the article right here all right so you see what it says expect deals from dented cars when i was in st louis in the day uh we had a tornado out of nowhere i was living in a ferguson area and i remember after the tornado passed through it was so much damage at the car dealerships that those cars were going for super freaking cheap so look at it says Late Sunday, hell pounded areas in Central Texas, including Round Rock and Georgetown areas. Hell reports included some hailstones between two inches and three diameter. OK, so guys, it's super easy to repair uh, this hail damage, right? But they don't feel like doing it right. And they know it's going to bring a lot of people in. A lot of that stuff can get covered by, you know, different programs and everything. So they ain't worried about it. So what do we do? Well, first, let me get you a different story, too. So we found two stories for the car dealership. So we came down here. There's a couple stories, right? Uh, where is it? I already got it open up. OK, so watch this one. So this one might even be even more scarier for dealerships right here. So we got BMO winding down indirect auto loans. OK, so. <laughs> The move by a Canadian lender appears to be on trend with other lenders also stepping away from their indirect auto loan business in a challenging market. So if you guys don't understand what that means is they're not going to be able to offer uh, uh, the car loans to local uh, uh, residents or people that come to buy. So here it goes. The bank has operated its indirect auto loan business uh, in which it works with car dealerships to set up buyer financing and then receives payments directly from the seller. So this allows the dealership to be able to collect the money and get the uh, customer up front. And then, you know, I'm saying the the, uh, the loan company, they deal with, their, with the customer from then point on to collect the money. Now, so what are some solutions for that and how are we gonna reach out to them? All right, so one way we're gonna reach out using these problems, right? We're going to use Facebook ads. So I'm going to show you how to put up a Facebook ad to be able to f uh, run these ads to target these customers for the hailstorms to get some new cars. And then I'm going to show you this right here. So before I show you the Facebook ad, this right here is National Business Capital. All right. You can become an affiliate of National Business Capital and you can get three to 12 percent of the loan for these businesses. OK, so check this out. All right. So what are we gonna do? We can either cold email, like I said, you can scrape the leads from over here, or you can just, you know what I'm saying, reach out to them by phone or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And you can say, hit them up and say, yo, I understand uh, that, you know, you guys don't have anybody to like, give you guys the loans for your customers right now. Cause this just came out, this happened. So a lot of them haven't replaced BMO yet. All right. So this would be your application, your trackable application, or you can co-brand it, put your uh, brand name on there right alongside with national. So they know that you're a partner and everything like that. 
And these people, you know, these car dealerships will be able to offer loans through uh, national business capital and you'll get a commission on every single car that they sell. So that is the true definition of standing in front of money that's already moving and making a freaking killing because they're getting foot traffic. People are coming in trying to buy cars all the freaking time. So just by you plugging in your funding, you're going to automatically have these dealerships working for you, bringing you loans every single day when you partner with them. I know, I know this is awesome, isn't it? Right. That's why when you go to the first pin comment it's going to take you over to agency to partner and we're going to insert 200 K extra into your agency guaranteed within the next 60 days. Go ahead and take advantage of that 200 is uh, 200 K within the next 60 days added into your agency without any extra retainers or upping your prices for your uh clients or anything like that so go ahead and take advantage of that all right so you can partner with them as well so we're going to close that out now this one is for this story right here round rock dealerships see hell damage expect deals for dented cars so you can do a couple things there's a couple ways you can reach out you can reach out by scraping the uh, the local numbers to the area and everything. Once again, you can use this tool right here located in the description uh, in the first pinned comment, but you can blast out to the businesses as well. So what you're going to do is you're going to create a recording, right? So this recording is going to say, yo, you guys remember that hailstorm a couple weeks ago, right? All right, well, our dealership is offering blank percent off. So you wanna obviously reach out to the dealership and see what type of deals they have and specials they have. And you wanna create an irresistible offer. The good thing about this is you create a 30 to 60 second um, voicemail clip and you can blast it out to pretty much everybody in the freaking city that has a cell phone. So you can have like a concert line uh, wrap around the corner for that car dealership very quickly if you can come up with a very good irresistible offer okay so that's how you can solve that google news problem that we found for uh the car dealership so now we'll close that that out yeah, and the ringless voicemail so that's the audio clip right there this is where you put the list of the numbers right here and then this is where you create the campaign all right so we'll close that out too so now we come over here to Facebook. All right, so we're gonna click on create. We're going to find objective. Objective is message, messages. We're gonna hit continue. All right, so the reason why you wanna do messages because you get cheaper leads. So you can do lead generation ad or you can do messages. Both of them work the freaking same to me. Um, you know, the whole goal is to keep them on uh, the platform. Okay, the whole goal is to keep them on the platform. All right, that's how you get cheaper leads. And guess what? If they go into the messenger, you can constantly follow up with them. But if you take them off the site, then you got to worry about uh, retargeting and knowing all that extra bull, right? All right, so check this out. What we're going to do for the location, guys, is we're going to put the city that the news is in. So this goes for uh, both of those Google News stories. Right, so it's a Round Rock, Texas, boom. All right, so boom. <laughs> Look how easy that is. As far as targeting goes, you don't need to do anything else for the targeting, boom. So we just hit, uh, is, you can keep everything. Uh, the only thing you wanna change maybe is the manual placements, okay? So we're gonna delete Instagram, audience network. We're just gonna keep all the Facebook stuff. We don't want this in stream ads or search results. Um, do we want that? Nah, we don't need stories or reels either. All we need is the feed. All we need is the feed. Okay, boom. So now we hit next. All right, so now we are here where you create the actual ad, right? All right, so we got this because I haven't been like, you know what I'm saying? I haven't set up everything because I'm just giving you guys an example. So we're going to hit preview. Uh, dev destination. All right. And I don't even have an image for this. I'm just showing you guys how it work. So basically you would say attention round, blah, blah, blah. And then you'll give them, you know, irresistible offer for the second line. So that's the formula for Facebook ad. You want to say something shocking, unbelievable, uh, a huge guarantee or promise, right? And then the second line of it, because remember after uh, the third line, 
everything else becomes below the fold. So you want to fit this formula in the top three lines. OK, so the first line will be your, you know, whatever you're trying to get to stand out, something that will stop them from strolling, blah, blah, blah. Like I said, round rock, they're going to, you know, that's personalization so that can help them stop strolling. Mentioning the hailstorm. I mean, I'm pretty sure that was big news that will help them stop strolling as well. And then the second line will be a resistible offer. Uh, if you come in today on top of getting the discount on this car, you're also going to get blank, right? Oh, a free gas card, whatever, blah, 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 you can come up with, right? Okay, and then the call to action would be, all right, go ahead and click the ad and then, you know, message us whatever, what time you can come in, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so that is the ad for that. And you want to get a picture. The creative will be a, a simple picture of... Uh, of one of the cars with the hell damage very simple all right very simple an arrow talking about deals right that would be it right there so go to i want you guys to go to the first pin comment right now and go and join the membership program from agency to partner what we're going to do is we're going to help you add an extra 200k to your months okay without adding any new clients you're going to enjoy equity benefits without investing in these businesses. We're going to show you how to turn agencies into uh, partners. All right. Go from agency to partners. All right. And what is the guarantee? If we don't add an extra 2K, if you don't add an extra 2K, 200K in the allotted uh, time, then we'll go ahead and get the partnerships and set them up for you. If you don't reach the amount of money, a 200K, right in the allotted time like if you're short of that money then we'll go ahead and transfer two of our already profitable partners to you all right so we'll literally just shave off two of our deals for you all right so the membership is only 497 not 497 a month is only 497 once then a tiny membership in order to stay active but that's it 497 I strongly suggest you go ahead and get in. As you guys saw, we show you things that nobody else is using. The reason why we get opens, the reason why we get replies, the reason why people partner with us is because we know how to stay ahead of the curve. All right. I'm showing you how to use Google News to get agency partners or clients. Right. No one else is showing that for free. All right. So go ahead and take action. That's in the first pin comment. Love you guys.